Hi guys, it's Kylie the Jellyfish today. Wow, that was a weird intro. Kylie the Jellyfish. Um, today I'm going to be dyeing my hair like aquamarine, arctic fox. But um, it's in this container right here. Um, the actual bottle is right here. It's mostly this. Random greens I have just to like throw in some extra tealness. And then I diluted it a bit because it... Um, Arctic Fox dye is super pigmented. I never really put this straight dye just on my hair because then I feel like I would waste a lot of the pigment because you can only overlay so much pigment before it would all wash off um, the stuff that doesn't stick to your hair. Any time I use Arctic Fox, I just throw in a lot of Arctic Mist Diluter, which is their white color that's basically just like a pastelizer. Like if you want pastel pink hair, you use like... You, you fill this whole thing up with this and then put like a dot of virgin pink, their pink color, and then the whole thing is pastel pink. It's really awesome because um, like these are so pigmented. Like I feel like it's the cheapest brand ever because I mean it is already like it's already way cheaper for more dye inside of it than uh, Manic Panic which is the most comparable dye to this one. Um, they're both vegan brands. They both have a lot of colors. They both um, semi-permanent, uh, easy application. You just put it on. You don't have to mix it with anything like peroxide or developer. Um, and it's just straight ready to go. And it already has like conditioner in it, so it conditions your hair while it dyes it. Um, but then it's also super pigmented, so um, you really can just use this much of it and this much diluter, and like it'll still be a vibrant color. It won't be like a pastel color, it'll be a vibrant color. Like, I used a lot of diluter in this. Okay, so let's just get started. I'm done with rambling. Um, lately, I've been having like acne issues, so if you can see my face is like kind of shiny because I have like medicine on it right now, and um, yeah, there's like some trouble spots here and there. I don't like using gloves, I love using just my hands because I love the way hands look when they're just like covered with dye. Like, I just think it's really beautiful and artsy looking. Um, but some people really are bothered by that. Like, some people are like, um, honey, you need to wear gloves, like on my comments, and I'm like, but I love color. Okay, so I usually start at the bottom and go up, like I put all of this up into a bun and then just little hairs at the bottom sticking out and then I start with those and then I take my hair out and I go up. But I decided to try something different and just like start from the top instead and I just want to see how that works out. You guys need to add me on my brand new Snapchat that I just made. It's Kylie Jellyfish. No spaces, no um, underscores, no numbers or no dots. It's all just Kylie Jellyfish, no the. Whenever I do art, I post a lot of my art on my Snapchat, and I know a lot of people say like they want to see more of my art because I do art. Um, I just don't show it that often um, because I never finish my pieces to my satisfaction. So um, I usually show work in progresses, but never like finished results. I haven't had my hair this color since uh, sophomore year, so like three years ago. Also, these gloves are super loose on me. They don't fit me, but. It makes it annoying. Like, it makes it feel like I can't feel where anything is. Just for public record, today is January... Uh, January 18th, 2017. Um, because, like, I have, like, 30 videos that I need to make, but my laptop has currently been broken for two months. And, um, I've been getting it fixed, but the guy just never gave it back to me yet. And, um, it's taking forever. So I'm super duper duper behind on videos and everyone's angry at me. Whenever I get my laptop back all the way through like April I'm guessing. Like I'm going to be scheduling videos that I'm making now and like last month. I feel like I've made so many hair dye videos that you guys know how I dye my hair at this point. Really these videos are just like if you want to watch me and you've like ran out of videos to watch this one is here for you. Hi. Since my roots are brown I don't really touch them with dye. Because I'm growing my hair out and I'm trying to keep it all like really healthy on the roots and um, I'm just dyeing what's already bleached. Because last year around this time I bleached all of my hair all the way to white. It was actually, yeah, it was last winter. And um, I've just been dyeing what's bleached ever since then. I've been letting my, my roots grow out just to see like how long I can actually grow my roots. 
Okay guys, so I have it all up in my hair now, and I'm going to leave it in for maybe like two hours. I could sleep in it because um, this, this brand actually says that you can sleep in the hair dye, it's gentle enough to do that. I'm actually going to work out while I let this sit in my hair, and then after my workout I like to take a shower. Um, I would say leave it in here for at least an hour though. I will show you guys the results.